Dear students, in this topic we shall discuss the concepts of osmoregulation and excretion. You know that water is the solvent in cells which makes solutions with solutes that is salts, electrolytes and ions which are dissolved in water. Each cell is adapted to a defined quantity of water in relation to salts to perform its functions normally. Changes in the concentration of either water or the solutes in it disturb the osmotic balance. Osmoregulation and excretion are those homeostatic mechanisms which maintain water and solute balance in the cell and in the body of an animal. Osmoregulation is the mechanism of regulation of solutes and concentration of water in the cells and body fluids of animals, while excretion is the mechanism which maintain, which eliminates nitrogenous wastes from the body. These metabolic nitrogenous wastes, for example, ammonia and urea, disturb the osmotic balance in animal cells at toxic levels. Chuke ye osmotic balance ko disturb karte hain, is liye in ki body se removal, in ki toxicity ki vaja se, in ki body se removal, yani ke excretion in tahai zururi ho. To maintain osmotic balance. Chuke ye osmotic balance ko disturb karte hain, aur in ko body se remove osmoregulatory system ke saath hi kiya jata hai, that is why the excretion and osmoregulation are correlated processes. Dear students, now we shall discuss the concepts of osmolarity. Cells consistently encounter changing extracellular environment. An external medium which contain which is dilute as compared to cells concentration of solutes. Cell ki jo concentration hai solutes ki uske mukable mein agar bahir ka medium dilute hai to such an external medium is called hypotonic. While a more concentrated external environment is termed as hypertonic. An environment which resembles in solute concentration to that of present inside the cell is termed as isotonic. Ye jo hypotonic, hypertonic or isotonic solutions hain or solutions ki ye jo concentrations hain, they are called osmolarities of the solutions. Ye jo osmolarity hai solution ki, it has wide effects on the performance of animal cells. Hypotonic environments osmotically cause the entry of water into the cell. This results in dilution of the cell contents and cause it to become turgid or swell or even burst. Hypotonic environments is ke opposite effects produce karte hain and they cause the cell to lose water and to cause the cell solution to become more concentrated. Dear students, now we shall discuss the importance of osmoregulation. Animal cells require a critical balance of water and solutes in the body. They cannot survive a net gain or loss of water. Water 
कॉन्टिन्यूसली बॉडी के अंदर एंटर भी होता रहता है और लीव भी करता है However, the quantity of water and solutes is kept in balance because of osmoregulation. 